Whoever came up with the rule of thumb that guy should make the first move must be six feet under by now. It's a totally outdated concept. Women have climbed the corporate ladder, battled with male politicians, so why couldn't they go ahead and make the first move when meeting men? It's always scary to take that first step. We are all sprinkled with ingredients of rejection in varying amounts. If only we could predict whether or not a person would turn us down, then we wouldn't bother to sit beside her and waste some $20 on a drink. If it's too much of a hassle for you to approach a woman, then just reverse the whole situation. Charm your way to her and let her make the first move. If there is one traditional formula to do that, that will be the magic of eye contact. Making eye contact, as simple as it is, can be a little tricky. The eyes can communicate a thousand words in those precious seconds you met her eyes. Make sure you have the right look in your eyes. How do you know when you've achieved the correct look? What's in your mind is basically what would be projected in your eyes. So if you are thinking to go get a girl and get her to bed, that tinge of lust would be caught in your eye. So the next time you sit in a bar or shop in a mall and see a woman you might want to have a date with, here's what you need to do. Stare seriously at her eyes, not at her legs or anywhere else. It doesn't matter if she is looking at you or not. It's a common thing for people to be conscious of the people looking at them. If she feels your eyes on her, she will eventually acknowledge that she knows you are looking by giving her own look. When this happens, simply smile back at her. Don't wink or lick your lips please. The few seconds you lock her in eye contact may be all the chance you're going to get to make an impression, so don't blow it. When she stares back that gives you the green light signal. It's even better if she gives you a shy smile, which simply means she's open to the thought of meeting you. Next thing you know, she might come up and say, hi, 